So this past week, uh, I've been playing a bit with printing some accessories for the Oculus Rift. The first one that I did was this, uh, this little holder for the Oculus Rift remote. I mean, it's really not a hassle to hold it in your hand or to stuff it in your pocket, but if you're doing things like watching movies or something where you don't want to have it in your hand the whole time, uh, after you're done watching the movie, you have to like grope around and find it on, on your countertop or dig it out of your pocket. So with this, you can easily just like clip it on your shirt or you know slide it in your pocket or on your belt you can hit all the buttons without uh, having to dig it out of your pocket and it just slides in and out of that real easy and then I decided I wanted to make a holster for the oculus rift touch controllers that aren't out yet um, so that if you were using them and you wanted to for example you know pick up your cell phone or get a drink of water or grab a hold of the mouse and keyboard or something, you wouldn't be setting down the controls which roll around a lot um, on your countertop. So I designed a super quick holster hook that sits on your belt and I found a, uh, a model of the Rift controller. This is not exact measurements. It's made by uh, King Rawl on Thingiverse. There's a link to that down below. So I printed this out, even though it had some problems printing, I didn't bother fixing it because this is just kind of a rough estimate so that you can slide it on and slide it back off. And this could just slide into your pocket, over your belt, whatever. And that way you can holster your, your Oculus touches quick and easy and uh, take them back off. But um, these files will be available on Thingiverse or if you want me to print you one, contact me and I will sell you one for cheap or something. I don't know. I'm still kind of iterating the design. I'd like to do the same thing for the Vive, but I don't have um, I don't have a Vive or even a mock-up of the Vive touch like motion controllers to even guess as to what size they are. So I'm kind of still figuring that out. And I'm sure that I'll iterate on this too. I wanted to keep it as flat as possible so that it wouldn't interact it wouldn't interfere with your arms whenever you're moving around. So that's why it's got this very flat design. But it just slides like if this is in your pocket, just slides right on like that. That's it.